It is like 7 a.m. but we just got to Jamaica. We're unpacking like really I'm super OCD about this and super Virgo about this and I unpack all of my stuff, hang my clothes, do all of that. I don't like living out of a suitcase when I travel but I have been successfully fitting all of my clothes in a carry-on bag and I really wanted to show y'all but I could never do a pack with me because whenever I'm packing it's like an hour or two before the flight and I'm just frantic and all types of stuff so I'm just gonna actually show y'all like my open up my suitcase and show y'all how everything looks this time when I tell y'all I packed super last minute super last minute so I don't even have like bags um, I normally will have like bags around my shoes and my bag and I didn't so let's pray that everything is okay okay let me show y'all so first this is a quick like update of this base luggage um, I love this luggage but I know a lot of people talk about if you get the beige color the little dings that you get this is just from carrying it on so can't imagine if I actually checked the bag um, I'm thinking about still getting this color for a check bag but getting um, the clear protectors on top so the bag has like this compression thing which I like I don't know what you really put in it I put a book in it um, and it has these compression straps which I like so on this side I really just put two um, of those luggage bag things but what I love about these cubes other than the other pack of cubes is that these have the compression straps inside the cubes I feel like it makes a big difference and I can fit a lot of stuff so that's like my clothes and this is like my swimsuits and like underwear and pajamas and stuff then on this side has like these zipper pouches think for like dirty stuff and wet stuff I don't have it filled right now but I probably will my liquids bag TSA and then literally like everything else so shoes hair products a jewelry box um, use this bag to hold like the non-liquid makeup items gotta have my fan I need to actually charge this fan up two things of sunglasses they just so happen to both be low weight sunglasses this time and my Jody was all the way under here this is like really really bad hey y'all so I'm gonna give y'all a quick uh, let's stick to this lighting right here okay so I'm gonna give y'all a quick view of my look for today very simple because I'm planning on just literally getting to the pool like getting straight to it need to get a bite to eat but pool is the most important objective but it's super super hot out there like way hotter than it was in DR but um these are Loewe sunglasses I love 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 these sunglasses highly recommend um Versace swimsuit I got this um little sarong cover-up thing from Amika's site it's like M-I-C-A-S Mika's I'll link it in the description but um I got this from them in like September for my birthday trip and didn't wear it and my Hermes I was like I hung up a few of my things, drawers, I put a few of my things in there. How cute is my little jewelry box? Oh, I just love... What's up? <laughs> I'm good, how you doing? Hey y'all, how y'all doing? Thank you, what y'all got? Oh, okay. I got my car, I know, that's 
Pops, that's so cute. That'll be so cute for tomorrow. Here's Sean Kimberly. Good. I'm the reason for all her followers. <laughs> Ladies over there, they said, um, oh, you here with your husband? And I was like, oh no, that's my boyfriend. So if somebody ever say, oh, you there with your wife, what you say? Oh no, that's my girl. Do you for real? Wave at me. OMG y'all, so I am rushing so bad. I ended up staying a little bit longer in class because I didn't want to have to worry about the assignment after miss. But basically, I'm ready and I'm about to go eat. And Paris is actually going to the rehearsal dinner. They didn't invite me. It's only like the wedding party, whatever, whatever. So I'm going with his friend and his friend's wife and um, they're dressing casual. We might be finding some type of Jamaica, um, Montego Bay nightclub type of thing. So, my leave out is like been off the chain. Got this Chanel scarf on to just not even have to worry about it. Wearing my Fendi hoops. Got this tank from Zara. Got these shorts from um, Top Shop and Hermes Slides, and I'm gonna wear uh, my Chanel little crossbody. Super easy, super simple, and I gotta go. Good morning. What is it like? Ten o'clock? Nine o'clock? Something like that? Nah. But we just got room service. That's the best thing like with these resorts. The room service is free. So I just grabbed the best stuff that I thought they had. So let's just try it. They do have ketchup. They do have sugar. But that's syrup. I had asked for grits. I had asked for grits. But okay. And this is a version of French toast. Hmm, okay, let's just try it and see. Oh, I should have took my camera with me, but last night we went to the um, little sports bar. That was your fast break. <laughs> All I do is talking to yourself. I was saying something that was God did not even understand what you just said. <laughs> Oh, thank you for this wheel for nursing around bodies. Amen. So, let me actually talk to y'all about this. So, this is the second wedding that Paris has been in. I was just in a wedding in October. And, um, so basically, like, I'm used to if I go to a wedding with him and he's in the wedding then I'm used to like, you know, he has to go do things, you know, like how I have to do things. The more, the day of the wedding, have to go do things and get ready. So be used to basically going to the wedding by yourself until like they're free, like all that kind of stuff, like that's normal. The rehearsal dinner became a whole topic of conversation yesterday because we're in Jamaica. We both flew here. I do not know or I did not know anybody else but him like I'm um, his plus one this is a wedding he's part of these are his people so rehearsal dinner they didn't invite me to go to rehearsal dinner or I asked him check and see if I can come because it's like we were gonna just eat dinner so if you have a rehearsal dinner like see if I can go so he said oh he said that i couldn't go that they said no luckily i had met his friends his friend his friend's wife earlier that day so i was just like okay cool i'll go eat with them so as soon as he told me no i text them and were like hey i can't go eat with paris so let me know like what time y'all go downstairs what time y'all want to eat blah 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 so they was like okay cool but 
when we actually got together, they were like very, I guess they just were not pleased at like the whole way that it was done. And was like, I should have been able to go eat with Paris because like I'm travel here. I would have been by myself. Like I'm his first one, blah, blah, blah. So um, I just think people with weddings need to be more considerate. No feelings about it. Hey y'all, so we about to head to the pool. Paris went to, I'm sorry if y'all hear this alarm, like the little speaker clock thing, the alarm's been going off. I don't know what to do. I've been pressing all the buttons. I don't know what to do, but head into the pool. Um, I'm like really gonna chill out. Like the couple that I do know, I think that they're gone somewhere else and I'm kinda okay with that. So I can do my own thing. I'm gonna bring my book and like just chill. Uh, Paris went to go get some food from the buffet. He said he's gonna meet me at the pool before he has to do like wedding stuff um i'm gonna first get some cash so hopefully the lady is still on the beach that i can get like the little sarong from it's something i met yesterday um because right now i just got on my swimsuit and like super basic so um yeah and i'll bring y'all with me because it's cool by the pool i was just nervous yesterday about bringing my camera um after dinner because they said we were gonna go to a like actual off resort Jamaican kind of vibes restaurant I mean bar club um, and the guys are gonna go to a strip club but then they start acting scary like after dinner everybody was like uh, it's not safe to go off the resort what no no it could have been fine and here like we have like butlers and stuff I hate to say that but that's what they call themselves but we have that in the resort and um, they offer to like drive us there sit outside like super super safe so if y'all aren't thinking about going to royalton do that and it's super safe but um yeah let me run and i'm gonna take y'all along with me today okay omg and y'all i forgot my beach bag um and the beach bag i did have like it would not fit in my carry-on and i'm not taking my goyard bag out there so this is actually a shopping bag that they give you like at the store <laughs> So, um, and it's just like a little cloth tote bag. So I've just been taking this with me to the pool, which is fine. Taking this book. My friend has a book club. Um, and this is the first book that we're reading. So I'm going to take this book. And I have my mini little fan slash phone charger situation too. But my phone is not um, dead. And I'm just going to take a little toiletry bag too with um, like hand sanitizer. Um it's so messy but like hand sanitizer and lip gloss and also my card is gonna be tucked away in here because I have to go up to the ATM so simple little toiletry bag um all right so let's go I kind of feel like I have to show with Amanda because I'm coming for Amanda hey. <laughs> I didn't believe you with the camera yes. you know, so I got look like you this morning uh-huh. No. And she said, oh, it's not me. Oh, no. She looked like you, though. Did she? You yeah. have the wraps? You want to say? Yeah. Oh, you got some food. Where's your, where was the head at? Where's that food at? Okay. Okay, I'm going to get some of that. It's okay. It's okay, yeah. This is my vlog for YouTube. My girl is loyal. 